In just 15 minutes, the Jewish Community Center will reopen its doors for the first time since shots rang out Sunday afternoon. The deadly shooting has police stepping up patrols in the area. Sayed Shabir is live there now with what's being done to try to keep people safe. Sayed. Jow, Jow, as we speak, there are officers from the Overland Park Police Department in the area keeping an eye out for anything suspicious. They won't say exactly how many patrols they've added, but they are working hand in hand with officials from the Jewish Community Center to try and keep everyone safe. Now, they, we talked to a mother who uh, frequents this area every day. She comes with her kids, and she tells us that she's not going to let this recent shooting control her. She plans on coming back, and she hopes others do the same. You have to get right back up on that horse and keep on riding. People can't stop you, stop the way you live. Now, this has been a place that people have come together of all faiths for the last 100 years, and this shooting isn't going to change that. In fact, this shooting is actually uh, feeding that fire of unity. Tomorrow morning, there will be a interfaith prayer vigil. Religious leaders from all different faiths, members of different religions will be coming together here tomorrow to pray for the victims of this shooting, as well as pray for peace in our community. That event is open to the public. It starts at 10 a.m. in the White Theater. The Jewish Community Center will open here in about 15 minutes. Uh, the fitness center will, and then the rest of the center will open up later this morning. Reporting live, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.